Welcome back. For our next story, meet assisted living facility owner and proud veteran David Carras. David was in need of financial support when a fellow veteran and his organization answered the call. They took a chance on a vision to help fulfill the America dream and a new approach to care for the elderly. David, we're going to start off with this letter that John wrote to you from Ready Capital. So if you could just read it out loud. Dear David. As a veteran myself, I've always found it hard to ask others for help. When you reached out to me directly in 2016, looking for capital to expand your business. It was not just a job for me. It became a mission to help you and your wife fulfill the American dream. From our first conversation, I felt a brotherhood and bond. There was no question. I wanted to be part of the history of loving home for mom and dad. David, your story is an inspiration for us all. Thank you for your service to our great country. Thank you for continuing to provide hope to the hopeless. And thank you for allowing myself and Ready Capital an opportunity to be a valued partner. Ready Capital is the largest non-bank lender to small businesses and investors in small balance commercial properties. We're the only firm that has focused on this niche in this space since the uh, recession. I wrote this letter a few weeks ago to David Carraz. When David called me back in 2016 and talked to me about loving care for mom and dad, you know, I thought just a, another assisted living facility what David kind of described was kind of a new approach to the care of the elderly. I um, had a tendency to look at a person who was disabled as perhaps uh, somewhat a little bit less than a uh, complete person. Those ideas changed when I myself was unable to walk. The rehabilitation process of which I experienced tremendous pain, I, I now have become a different person, a more compassionate person, and it's helped me crystallize my next phase of life should be, and that is in trying to help some of these people who don't have a home or are medically homeless, who suffer from many of the same things that I've experienced. Well, our strategic view is to become the largest non-bank lender to small businesses and investors in small balance commercial properties. Here at Ready Capital, uh, we provide financing to small business owners, entrepreneurs, and veteran-owned businesses. David and his wife, Mia, just happened to fit all three of those, those key categories. When David called me, it was... Uh, he was just trying to figure out how do, I, how do I get there? How do I get from point A to point B? You know, it's not a traditional uh, lending process. Said, Who's going to finance on this? How are we going to go ahead and meet our, our, our goal here? How are we going to handle this? Ready Capital came to our, to our aid. I met John Mosher. I spoke with him and told him what we were doing, told him what we are about. It stepped up to the plate. What was really cool is that we were able to kind of walk David through the process and, and kind of understand what their motivation was and where, where their uh, sense of purpose was in, in, in trying to find, you know, find a solution for them. They took a chance on a new model for the retired disabled vet to go ahead and put together the financing that was critical. So uh, it, word got out that, that these homes were here and they were so successful. Ready Capital made this possible. Ready Capital is a growing business and we want to help out growing businesses. 